And well, speaking of Amanda Muse, she's also back and she goes from traditional Newfoundland music to big band jazz. Here she is with your community. Since 1997, Jazz East has been delighting audiences with their big band sound. Well, this weekend, they'll be hitting the Arts and Culture Center stage in St. John's for the very first time. Jazz East is a big band uh, that is a this sort of traditional jazz ensemble, which is a 20-piece band, five uh, saxes, four trombones, five trumpets, full rhythm section, and a vocalist, and myself. So it's, it's sometimes called a jazz orchestra. Yeah, we're so excited. It's been almost two years since we've all been together, and we did do a Christmas concert, but it was the social distance edition so it was like the saxophones would play together for a piece and then the trumpets would play together for a piece but we haven't performed all together on a stage uh, in almost two years. actually going to be um, honoring one of the jazz greats. Tell us about that. We are. We're going to be honoring Phil Nimmons and uh, Phil is known as the Dean of Canadian Jazz. Phil turned 98 about 10 days ago and he was my teacher at the University of Toronto and he's Canada's most well-known arrangers and composers of jazz big band music and also uh, can you, uh, contemporary classical music as well. Um, but he's really well known for his big band writing. He had a band in the 60s called Nimmons and Nine, and then he added more players. It became Nimmons and Nine plus Six. So the show is this Saturday, June the 19th, at the St. John's Arts and Culture Center at 8 p.m. Um, so you can book tickets online if you're booking in bubbles of two, but for larger groups, you can call the box office uh, to help you more with their availability.